Uh, this is a great initiative by government of India and government of Mauritius. So you have launched two things. One is the rupee cut. So in Indian NPCI and uh, Bank of Mauritius together has launched this rupee cut. So Mauritian citizen can take this rupee cut and go to India and do smoothly transaction on it. Second, UPI one. UPI phase one is that uh, Indian customer will come here and uh, scan the QR code here on the Mauritian and the Mauritian's merchant's QR code and the payment will be made. So the Indian tourists who are coming here can make a smoothly payment on uh, scanning the QR code. Similarly, when the Mauritian people will go to India, so they with our app, they can scan the QR code in India and can make directly payment from their account. In that way, they reduce the hassle of currency transaction. They need, need not to carry the currency and as long as they can uh, use to do the marketing uh, as much as they can. So there is no limitation for the currency they are holding. So this is a great initiative from the part of the Bank of Mauritius and Government of Mauritius and India government. So, so actually we are the implementing bank first here. So we are implementing here and afterwards that other banks will come. So first the implementation has been started. So now anybody can come to our bank and uh, with in their account or can open the new account to have a rupee card or this UPI scanning app, our Yono app and they can go to India and do this thing. Uh, in Mauritius also in rupee card they can uh, uh, get the normal card payment they can uh, that can be work on any ATM also here so there is no problem. Uh, linking SBI means if you want to say the SBI India so this is uh, the UPI code in India can be scanned through our SBI Mauritius app, Yono app. So our SBI Mauritius Yono app they will take with this app and in, through this app they will scan the code and the payment will be made through that account which is maintained at SBA Mauritius. Pour plus de vidéos, cliquez sur like, abonnez-vous en cliquant sur subscribe et activez la cloche de notification pour rester informé.